guys, um, it's me, Ariel. So, um, I have these questions that I'm supposed to answer, or you're supposed to guess, or something, so I guess Hannah will decide how this works. All right. What was my first memory of meeting Judith? I think... If I remember correctly, I saw her, I saw, I think I saw you at, I think I saw you at Sinai. That's it. I saw you at Sinai. Every night in my dreams, I see you. Uh, all right. So what is the first conversation topic I had with Judith? The first real conversation topic I had with Judith was about the Jewish Enlightenment um, in like the 1700s with uh, Moses Mendelssohn and all that stuff because we were in USEM together so all those freshmen who are listening to this video you should take USEM because you're going to meet your Beshert there that is how I know you go all right, what is Judith's most repeated sentence or phrase? Uh, okay, there are a few good ones. Let's see. Um, when she's, I don't know, in a funny mood and she like wants like people to listen to what she's saying, then she says like, you guys, but you know, like, you guys, I just blah, 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 or you guys, isn't this funny? Except... It's especially funny when you're the only one who she's talking to. What would be the first thing Judith would say to the police officer if she pulled over for speeding? <laughs> That's a great question. Uh, all right. She would probably be, well, she would totally be so compliant and like, um, and and she would be like really calm sounding, but she'd be like freaking out. Um, and she'd probably, I don't know, pull out the wrong uh, license or whatever, and 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 she'd be really cute. I believe the heart go on. Um. All right. What is one secret that Judith doesn't think that I know? Uh. Gosh, I think Judith knows everything that sh I think that she doesn't know that I know. Um, um, yeah, I think I don't have any secrets from Judith. Alright, if Judith had to either bungee jump or zip line over a sea of crocodiles, which one would she do? I hope that she would zip line across the sea of croc crocodiles because bungee jumping is a vertical fall, which would defeat the purpose. So I think Judith would make the right choice. Everyone's and a little bit racist sometimes. Doesn't mean we go around committing hate crimes. Alright, number seven. If you and Judith were to be a dynamic duo, which one would we be? Uh, huh. Well, let's think what dynamic duos are there. Um, probably Batman and Robin. Probably Batman and Robin because, um, Robin is shorter than Batman is, just like Judith is shorter than me. You just kidding. the door. Okay, what does Judith prefer, the beach or the snow? No question, the snow. And she's so proud of her small town, Pittsfield roots. You can ask her about it. Oh, that's probably one of her favorite repeated sentences or phrases. I love Pittsfield. Okay. What is Judith's ideal date? All right. Um, Judith's ideal date, uh, 
Let's see. She'd pro. Um, let's see. A surprise trip to Walden Pond. No, just kidding. That was probably the worst date ever. Well, definitely something. Um, something private and romantic where there's no one, not a lot of other people around. Like a picnic. Yeah, I think Judith's ideal date is a picnic. Love was the way that I loved you One true time I don't... What was Judith's worst haircut? Okay. Mohawk, no question. That was a bad idea. Oh, What music was Judith first interested in on Broadway? Well, I guess I think I think she started out with Les Mis. I hope she did, because that's my favorite. And we're getting married, so she I hope she likes Les Mis, because she's gonna be hearing it for the rest of her life. The sun is strong, it's hot as hell below. No doubt. Um, number 12, if you and Judith were to tour around the U.S. as a musical couple, what would the name of your group be? Um, we'd probably be called The Sweet Judith. Um, yep, so that's it for now. Um, alright, keep having fun. I hope this was entertaining. Okay, I, oh. I love you, Judah. Is she embarrassed now? All right, bye. Shalom Shalom